Yo, what is good, you guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another WWE 2K22 video. And uh, once again, hope uh, everyone is having a wonderful WrestleMania weekend. Uh, like I said, I'm, I'm not able to watch it this year. Uh, probably gonna have to you know just pick up the Blu-ray whenever that drops. You know what I'm saying? So I don't miss out. I have been uh, keeping up with it though, watching the highlights on YouTube and whatnot. But anyway, let's go ahead and get right into this next video, shall we? Now. I think I want to save the Humberto uh, storyline for last on this video. I think I want to go against Ziggler first. And then Tommaso Ciampa is currently the U.S. champion, but I think I want to hold off on that. Let's, let's see if we can deal with Ziggler's worth first. So throwback Thursday. Remembering how I used to dominate Raw Underground every week. Probably shut it down because no one could compete with me. So too bad I missed out on the Raw Underground fun. Your college wrestling background would have been no match for my MMA experience. Yeah, I gave my dude the same MMA background as I gave uh, Alice Henderson. <clears throat> so, Raw Underground is no more, but we can still have a Raw Underground style match. Submissions and knockouts only. No exiting the ring. That worked for you, JV? Shit. Challenge accepted, my guy. Let's go. Look forward to showing off. I like how I did that. Uh, what a real fighter looks like. Let's go. So throw hashtag throwback Thursday. All right, so we cannot exit the ring. You can only win by uh, knockout or submission. So basically, it's an MMA style match. See if we can make him submit early. Ah, let's go. Here is your winner, the outlaw. See, uh, Shane McMahon. Shout out to Ziggler and JV for the Raw Underground style match. Nice to see a bit of tribute to my creation. Anytime, Shane O'Mac, by the way, always wondered why you didn't compete on Raw Underground. Not too late to fix that. I see where you're headed with this, JV, and I don't want any part of an MMA-style fight against you. No thanks. So, Eric, if you're looking for another fight, JV, I miss mixing it up on Raw Underground 2. Want to step in the ring with me? Guess you'll have to do, Eric. Overlook me and you will pay. Join the raid. Well, let's go. Let's go, my guy. Oh hell! Nope. Stunner. Dude, stop sitting up, man! What the hell? Come on now. Let's go. And not what I meant to do. Hold on, hold on. Gas up. And let's go for it. Rock bottom. Oh, 
Followed by with a Uranagi, and now I think we're ready to submit him. See, now that I got those two warmed up, warm up fights out of the way, there's one more opponent I want to face, Shane McMahon. Flatter, but no thanks, JV. What happened to the Shane I used to watch? The one who would throw himself off cages, challenge the toughest men on the roster. That Shane wasn't afraid of anything or anyone. Don't push me. Must be a letdown to your sons to see their dad back down from a challenge i'm just saying that's it i've heard enough i'm coming to raw for a fight let's do this there's the shane i know facts let's go i mean hey you want to push somebody to fight hey sometimes you gotta go the route of bringing up the children you know what i'm saying that'll get anyone to fight guaranteed well yeah what up shano Come on, bruh. Oh. Oh, Shano fight him back. Ah. Wait a minute, he missed? Nope. Make you tap for that shame. Cover so you stay clean. All right, throwback Thursday is complete, and I think we got time for one more. Said so nothing but respect to Shane McMahon. Brought it harder than a lot of old MMA opponents did. Won't question his toughness ever again. Yeah, hey, you're my respect. So I am the face of, of Raw, the longest reigning U.S. champion in WWE history. Goldie walked so Stripey could run. Hmm. Tease match called Champa Soft. Is that one heart emoji for each time you've been injured? Softest sports entertainer of all time. Ooh. Said no, it's one for... Each ass you kiss to get here. Hmm. Oh, really now? Threaten to injure Champa. Propose match. Well, we're going to propose match. We ain't, we ain't trying to turn heel just yet. If I'm just an ass kisser, then you should have no problem continuing your title streak against me. You're right. I shouldn't. Accept my challenge. So accept my challenge unless you're scared of losing your precious stripey. Uh, Mandy Rose, give Ass Kisser what he wants so he'll leave me alone. I'll earn a shot at you. You can keep Stripey for now. I'll earn a shot at you. Don't need Mandy Rose to give me anything. I'll earn a shot at you and Stripey. So Stripey, 
Ooh, and if we complete this, we unlock some bottoms, and we unlock LAW Arena, or Law Arena, as I like to call it. I mean, it's, it, it spells law, so why not? And anyway, I'm glad they brought back some of these arenas that you would see in 2K20. You know what I mean? They brought them back for a much better game. I'm just saying. <laughs> Uh, United States Championship picture is heating up this Monday on Raw. It will be JV versus Samoa Joe versus MVP versus Humberto in a fatal four-way match to determine who will face Ciampa. Uh, predictions? My prediction is the winner of the fatal four-way will lose to the greatest U.S. champion of all time. Also predicting if JV wins, it will be a bloodbath. Ooh, let's go. Let's go. Eat that MVP. Let's go. We're going to try to end this off early. Damn it. Stop me. Come on, guys, stay busy, stay busy. Um, nothing's happening. Come on, does. Damn it. Damn it, Humberto, get off me, you punk. Get off. MVP is mine. You got a dance partner. He's outside. Go we'll get him. Oh, you little bitch. Get the. All right, Joe. You want some? You gonna get it? You want some, huh? Huh? You want some? All right, where's Joe at? The punk ass up. Come on, Umberto. You can eat the stunner. Crap, Joe's coming. Oh, hell no! Get off me! No! You asshole. Punk. Get off me, punk kid. Oh, hell. No. No. Oh, come on. How can I be stunned already? Oh, come on, dude. Come on. Two hours later. Come on. Get up. Get up. Shit, 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 shit. Come on, come on. Tap out your bitch. Thank you. Woo! Here is your winner, the outlaw, Jason J. V. What an explosive fatal. So congratulations, JV. Both our wishes came true. 
mine to face you and your death wish. You know what I can take. You know what I can take from you. Not just your championship, your livelihood. How many more injuries can you survive? How many more comebacks do you have left before your body quits on you? I guess we'll find out. You mistake my injuries as a weakness, but it's the opposite. My scars make me stronger than you'll ever be. Uh, yeah, in, in your own warped mind maybe, but that's really not the case. Your scars are targets, and if I hit them, your record-breaking reign with Stripey will be over. If you're so confident, then forget about having a normal match. Let's do something that will prove whose body will break first. You choose. So last man standing, Iron Man. Let's do extreme rolls. Because I can put him to a table. Okay, you and me extreme rolls. Perfect. Now I can really make your death wish come true. Oh my goodness, the United States Championship. And we gonna take it home, baby. Introducing the challenger from San Jose, California, weighing in at 267 pounds, the outlaw, Jason J.V. Oh yeah. And introducing the champion from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Weighing in at 201 pounds, he is the WWE United States Champion, Tommaso Ciampa! This is all for the highly decorated Get a good look, bro. It's the States last time you're going to see that belt up close and personal. I'm telling you. Champion, truly a tough man's title. Oh yeah, I'm ready. Let's do this. I think I like that US design better than the previous one. Has more physical than any right out the gate. Come on, bruh. Come on. How about that death wish? Come on, man. What happened with all that mess he was talking on social media? And we gonna fly like the eagle. That's how it is. Dress up. Oh, he moved. Uh-uh. We know so that shit. Oh. oh, oh, oh. I'm going to fire under him. Nah. Nah, bruh. Nice try. Eat that. Now you can eat this submission. I could end it right now. I'm so tempted to. I don't think I want to. I think I just want you to suffer a little bit. So tempted. I'm so tempted. Come on, bruh. Some asshole. Let's go. Wee! Get on up. Right, he's in trouble. Oh, bring your Rudy Poo candy ass on up. Whoa. 
away from the ropes. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Respect. Respect. And just like that, you a puss bag. Oh. the hell oh And that is mine, dude. To part ways with Stripey after all. He's leaving with the United States Championship. Just all around disgraceful actions that we've witnessed here tonight. In any event, you're a paper champion. Updates on the new champion's condition. Here's an update. Not good. See, breaking after the post-match attack uh, by Champa, we received word that JV has suffered three broken ribs and will be out of action for up to six weeks. So two and a half months? Are you kidding me? We'll have further updates as they become available. You are right. Someone did get hurt. Stripey says hi. Due to the injury to JV, I'm reversing the outcome of the United States Championship match and returning the, U the U.S. title to Champa Mandate Raw. <laughs> Talking about having shit handed to you. I just saw your post. You're stripping me of the title I just won? Yeah, because I just saw your x-rays and you're going to be out for over a month which is a month without the U.S. Championship being defended on Raw. I have no other choice. You never wanted me to beat Ciampa? All you care about is keeping his record-breaking reign going for the brand and ratings. That's my job to care about that stuff. Besides, we wouldn't be having this conversation if you weren't soft. <laughs> That's what you called Ciampa, right? Bitch, I know you didn't just call me soft, and you're lucky I... Not okay! He attacked me after the match. You know, the match where I beat him. Look, you can go to the Performance Center, rehab your injury, then come back at full strength, and you'll most likely have a rematch waiting for you. Most likely? A lot can happen in six weeks. The alternative is you face Ciampa for the championship next week while gasping for air with the chest full of broken ribs, most likely lose, and then maybe never get a shot again. But either way, the title's returning to someone who can defend it immediately at 100%. So what do you want to do? I don't care what you, Ciampa, or anyone else says about being soft. I'm not going to risk my career for one match. I'll be back for my U.S. title when I'm 100%. All right. I'll let the PC know you're coming. So this is very much like the story where um, Nia Jax attacked my girl Alice Anderson and put her out for a while and she had to rehab her injury at the Performance Center in order to, you know, to build herself back up enough strength to, you know, to finally uh, defeat Nia. Uh, let's see, Chase. Hey, sorry to hear about what happened with Champa. But I can help start you off on your road to recovery at the PC. It'll be just like old times. I guess. Let's see if I can end this quick. Because we are at orange health. Chase, that reversal is not helping me. You're not helping me, Chase. What the hell, man? You're supposed to be helping me, not hurting me further. punk ass up man now I am motivated to hurt you get your ass up and you gonna eat the submission 
And you gonna love it. Screw you, ref. This guy is gonna tap. What the hell? I'm pressing the right buttons to get the submission on. Come on, put him in submission already. Fuck sakes. So update, back at the PC where it all started. Ribs already feeling better. We'll be back stronger than ever to reclaim what's mine. Hashtag Stripey. My update, still greatest US champion in history. Greater than Austin, Piper, Cena, and definitely JV who held Stripey for less than an hour. Who's your daddy? Oh, 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 oh my guy, my guy. We is talking some serious serious payback see watching you train with chase got me feeling nostalgic uh about your time here at the pc so for your next match you're you're going to be stepping into the ring with the do double g me better bring it because i won't be taking it easy on you well that's fine because i won't be taking it easy on your ass and i'm gonna send you right back to your dog house let's do this come on deal double oh easy now it's still a little tender, man. And, oh, hell. Mm -mm. No selling. Nope. And we're going to stretch you out. Back to the doghouse, you go. See, putting in the work and almost 100% back soon to take back my U.S. championship that I never lost. Might be good to see your progress firsthand. Maybe Stripey and I will make a little trip. Oh, I hope you do come. I hope you do come. We think you're ready for one final tune-up match, so we've arranged for you to face someone who knows Ciampa better than anybody. Johnny Gargano. Yeah, that's not really a tune-up. Or, yeah, that's not really a tune-up, but okay. Uh, nope, but it's the best way to, f to prepare you for what you're going to face when you return. And one more thing, you need to get reacclimated to the pressure of performing in front of an audience. So your match with Gargano is going to take place at an LAW indie show. Good luck. Let's do it. Ooh, they kind of... They kind of hooked up this new um, LAW arena. Oh, snap. Uh-uh. Kick his mask to his face. Get off me, man. You in cahoots or what? Ooh, a busted Gargano wide open. Let's go. Uh oh. Damn it. Uh-uh, we, we, we ain't selling that. Nope. Punk ass. Oh. 
Oh yeah, it's done. Yeah, I like what they did with the LAW arena, man. I think it looks a lot better than it did in 2K20. That's for damn sure. Yo, you got the big old disco ball right there. That might be a thumbnail. So, didn't, so if you didn't hear the greatest U.S. champion of all time uh, jump me at LAW event because he knows he can't beat me straight up. Bad news for him. I'm cleared and coming for my title. It was nice seeing you, but you should have stayed down at the PC unless you want more broken ribs. Oh, I got your broken ribs right here, buddy. So don't miss the return of JV take on to take on uh, Champa for the for Stripey in a ladder match. Who will walk away the U.S. champ after this brutal encounter? Well, if there's tables involved, then I have a pretty good idea who can walk away with that strap. Let's go. It's been a long road to this you little bitch, get your ass up. Been a long time for this. Oh, we're gonna make it difficult for you to climb up these ladders. Come on, old man River. Now you know how my wrist felt. Kind of. Right in the mouse. Punch <clears throat> out of my ring. Your noggin knows how my ribs felt. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Your punk ass over here. Maybe it's a lot set. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. No, come on. And knock my table down to you, bitch. Get your punk ass down. Oh, you put a crack in the table. Bitch ass over here, you bitch. Oh, we're gonna fly. We're gonna fly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sir. You bitch. We ain't done yet. We just getting started. Get your bitch ass on that table. I said get your bitch ass on that table. Get on the table. 
destroy his opponent right now. Watch his I got one more in the tank. All right. Let's go get this ladder. Grab the ladder, genius. Oh, follow him the ladder? Ah, barely. Barely missed it. Champa is in some serious trouble. Champa needs to rely on his intensity here. Going to get that ladder. The punk ass off me. The bitch. Fuck you. You're on. Make sure you can't climb. Now you know exactly how my ribs felt. Oh, you bitch. Fuck you. Oh, you motherfucker. Bitch. Making sure that ladder's in place. Fuck you. Work the legs now. We're gonna work the legs now. Stop squirming, you bitch. You're gonna need a full body cast when I'm done with you. Bitch ass up. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Get out of here. Get up. Apparently I have a sig too. You gonna eat this feet? Wait, what? Wait, there wasn't even a table there. He acted like there was a table there. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. This ain't Montreal. We ain't gonna have no screw jobs up in this piece. The bitch ass. Nah, dude. Not close enough. Can I even reach it from here? Nope. Nope. Get out of my ring, please. Thank ya. You piece of trash. Alright, can we put this in the middle of the ring? Hell. Can we get this properly placed, please? It's not close enough. And how do you swing this at people? Oh, hell no! Come on, after everything we've done to this guy, let's go! You gotta be fucking kidding me after everything we've done to him. What's he gonna do here? 
all red. All red everything. But all red health, come on. Damn. And I can't get this ladder in the fucking middle of the ring. Attempt to win by grabbing the championship. Well, you're not giving me the opportunity to grab the championship because I'm trying to put this damn ladder in the middle of the ring and it's not working. I don't know if 2K don't ruin this with their update or what the hell. Shit. But I feel like I'm being set up here. hell out of here come on let's go for the belt see I, I can't reach the damn belt why and it's like right there oh now it gave me the prompt but too late now he's getting up like as if he's immune to shit get the hell away from that ladder you bitch fuck out of here Piss off! And you were putting underneath the objective where I can't see it? Shit, what's he gonna do? Oh no. No! No, 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 no! Damn it! I got the wrong thing. Motherfucker! Come on already! This is fucking aggravating, man. This guy should be like so fucking hurt he can't really move. He's on the fucking ladder. I gotta pick him up, throw him out of the fucking ring, and he's gonna get right back up. Like, for real, this is some fucking bullshit. Like, what the hell kind of shit is this? Stay down, dude. This is aggravating. I'm standing in the middle of the damn ring and this dude set up the ladder like towards the side. It's like I want it in the middle of the ring and he's putting it anywhere but. Fuck out of here. This game is aggravating. This fucking match is aggravating. I'm fuck I'm seriously heated now. Dude! Get the fucking ladder! Thank you! Get out of here, man! Damn! 2K, y'all need to patch the ladder physics. That is freaking ridiculous. Just when I thought I had it in the middle of the ring, it still seems like it's off. Look at now it's letting me grab it. And of course Tommaso is getting on his feet. Shit! No! No! You fucking... No! Fuck! Fuck! No! Uh-uh. Fuck you. Get your fucking ass up, man. I'm sick of this shit now. I'm fucking aggravated. Like, for real, for real. Aggravated. Get the fuck out of my ring. And now I can see the fucking minigame. And it's done. Shit. That was the most aggravating ladder match I've ever played. 
They need to do something about having that mini game hidden underneath the objective. I can't stand that. that they, need, they need to put that mini game either somewhere else or take the objective off the screen when the mini game pops up. Because that is annoying as hell. So anyway, Strike B storyline is complete and I am calling it a video here guys because that was the most aggravating storyline I freaking played, man. That shit was annoying. That ladder match fucking killed it for me. But anyway, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I sure as hell did up until that ladder match. Um, but anyway, uh, hopefully you guys will consider subscribing. You know what I'm saying? Liking, sharing, all that fun stuff. Uh, yeah, especially uh, subscribe if you're new here, you know what I mean? And uh, if you're feeling the vibes over here. And uh, don't forget to check out, of course, all the the uh, links in the video description down below. That would mean the world. And uh, yeah, it's your boy Jason JV. and y'all take care. I'll bless one. Catch y'all next one. Peace.